Welcome back to Beer Barbecue Baseball. Velton's Pilsner. Coming from Germany. It's got a date on the bottom of the can of August 31st, 2022. So we're in pretty darn good shape here. Uh, it is part of the beer purity laws of 1516, uh, which does state that you're only allowed to use water, barley, and hops for ingredients. So, um, kind of excited to try this since it's in a can I'm hoping it's not skunky and uh, it is made with its own uh, natural spring water uh, this was voted uh, world's best beer in uh, 2070 2017 world beer awards so hey maybe I'm building it up too much and I might be let down but we'll find out Gonna be drinking it out of a Pilsner glass. So let's get it open. If I didn't mention it before, it is 4.8% alcohol by volume and 30 IBU. So this is gonna have that typical drying Pilsner effect there at the end. So here we go. Give it the aggressive pour. there and look at that big I'm afraid to show this to you but ah, mosquitoes are everywhere big frothy head produced a lot of I don't know if you can see that a lot of big bubbles in there decent amount of carbonation but it has a nice straw looking color to it Mm. Yeah, it smells really nice. Hmm. Smells fresh. Let's get a, a sip on it. Yeah. That's nice. It, you can definitely tell it's got 30 IBUs. I mean, it's, it dries out in your mouth really quick. And then you get the bread crust flavor. Yeah. Nice. I get maybe just a just a touch of citrus in there. Not sure where that's coming from. Yeah, this is very nice. It's uh, easy to drink. It's great for a warm summer night ironically on untapped it only has a 3.17 rating mm. this tastes fresh and it's now a lot of people drink pilsners and they don't expect it to be dry but pilsners typically finish out pretty dry Nice lacing it. Lacing hangs around there. It's really nice. Very nice. Let's pour the rest of this in here. Now this can cost me like two eighty six or something like that. It wasn't very expensive. Good. I'm assuming that's a 16 ounce can. The aroma is real subtle. The pilsners don't pack a lot of flavor. Um, it 
but you get that, you know, that dry bread crust flavor in here. And I kind of get it on the aroma as well. It's pretty good. I like this one. I'm going to give it a 3.75 from Beer Barbecue Baseball. If you've had this one, let me know. It's Velton's Pilsner. So, let me know your thoughts. 1824 is the date of establishment. And, uh, yeah, go get you one. Give it a try. Thanks for watching, and we'll talk to you all later.